recording, we will say hello, YouTube. Uh, you will notice now that I am a good deal stronger than when we last left off. I have done a good chunk of grinding. I'm still a little scared because this is wizardry. Um, so for people who uh, may not know, I post these to YouTube and uh, someone left a YouTube comment saying this was cozy content. Um, I appreciated that. That was very nice. The commenter. Um, as, as the streamer, I can say uh, Wizardry 2 is cozy precisely 0% of the time. So if this here, if this emote here is you as the streamer, uh, maybe, or you as the viewer rather, maybe you are doing this while you watch the stream. Um, I, because this is Wizardry, I consistently look more like this every single step of the stream. At several of these moments, you can see several of them in the YouTube highlights. But, regardless, it's time. It's time to move on here. So, like I said, I've done much grinding. We inspect our characters, we can see Kyli. All our fighters are now level 25. Zerdly is level 24 and has maximum spell charges on all their priest spells. Tubes is level 18, due to kind of joining a little bit late. By the way, how is the balance on everything? Uh, that looks pretty good. Okay. Mike.com is level 26. Being a thief, he gains levels faster. Um, okay, let's, let's not play around here. Let's go into the maze. Let's... The only thing I really need to do here is this. I guess I'll also do this. This may turn out to be a very short stream, depending on how this next few minutes plays out, by the way. We're gonna go down here. And we're gonna come back in here, and we're gonna refight the Knight of Diamonds Gauntlets. An encounter. Alright, they... Alright, so regular fight. So, nothing we can do here in terms of that. Fight, fight, fight. Uh, we're gonna do kind of the same thing we did before. We're just gonna kind of sling some spells as sort of a Hail Mary. We're not expecting these to work, but we're gonna go with it anyway. Alright, so lag.com is hiding. That's a good start. Shubes tries a tilt wait. Did not work. Didn't think it would. Alright, Magic Gauntlet's attacked. That's fine. Magic Gauntlet's cast Mahalito. That's fine. That is not tilt wait. That hurts, but it's not tilt wait. All right, nine times for 100. Okay, magic gauntlet, let's resist. Magic, yep, that's what I expected there. Okay, we killed one of them. That's good. Um, I don't exactly know what to do here. I guess we can try Modzi on Silver, which I know is a weird play, but Silver is the one who has Rathnir, which is the strongest weapon, so that's why we're doing that. Um, Shoes can't really do a whole lot to help us here, I don't think. I guess we can try slinging a second tilt away and see what happens. Mercury tries to stab. Eight times for 91. Magic Gauntlet is killed. Okay, we're good. Alright, and Kyle found gauntlets. So, next thing we're gonna do... is this. We are going to take... Shoes. Actually, before we do that... Cast the Lomilla here. Okay, so clearing that square, it actually looks like cancels out Lomilla? Because I definitely just cast that. And it's definitely like, no you didn't. I need to keep that in mind. Okay, yeah, so Lomilwa just does not work on this floor. Okay, I see. Very good. All right, and we get more back to the castle, which is what we wanted. Okay. Madi, everyone up here. Okay. 
up. Shoes, reservoir. Those up. Okay, so now we need to kind of re. Well, first. First things first, we need to. We need to grab those gauntlets. Uh, who actually got the gauntlets? It was Kyle. Alright. So, alright, we have the Cod's Gauntlet. Nice, nice. Okay. Alright, so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna kind of. Uh, we're gonna rejig our equipment a little bit here. Um, okay, so I like, yeah, okay, so I like this. I like Rathnir, I like having three there. We're gonna take off Silver's Helmet, actually. We're gonna trade that to, we'll trade the Helm. Trade the Helm to Kyla. Keep your Sword of Slashing, your Sturdy Plate, your Shield. You equip the Helmet, you leave that on. Okay, so we'll trade, we'll give you, we'll give Mercury the Cod's Gauntlets, and we'll give Silver the Helm of Hardiness. Okay, so... Mercury with the weakest weapon is the one most likely to be slinging the Cod's Gauntlets around, which is nice. Um, Highlight with the second weakest weapon, although albeit one that gives a bunch of hits, is more prone to using the Cod's Helmet. Excuse me. And last but not least, uh, Silver with Hrathnir is just going to Okay, so we do need to actually equip Silver with the Helm of Hardiness. There we go. Copper. Alright, so we have... We have fighters with a class of minus 8, minus 7, and low. Alright, and they regenerate HP with every step, which is a little less important with the College Shield, but it's nice to have. It's nice to have in battle. Nice to be able to regenerate. Okay. Let's just one more time do this. Okay. So, I would like to pose a... Before we move on here, I would like to pose a little bit of a riddle to you. Um, you know what, just in case. Okay, then we're gonna do this. Shoes, those shoes. Okay. We're gonna come down here. We're gonna take the stairs down to the sixth floor here. So, here is my riddle to you. How do we map out the sixth floor? Now, I know where we start. We start at zero, zero. I just happen to know that. But, I'll show you why I asked this particular question. Floor 6 is like any other floor. It's got teleporters, it's got spinners. I think it has a dark square or two, which is a little bit redundant, since it seems like Lenola doesn't work here anyway, but all that is neither here nor there. So if you'll notice, um, if I try to... Let's see, where is it? There it is. So normally, if I use the Ring of Jewels, that's a do mapic spell, that's our map spell, but it fizzles out. And so you can say, well, I can try to cast Malore. And if I try to go to floor six, which is where we are, we just bounce back to where we are. So how do we, how do we map this out? I'll let you all think about that for a few seconds. So, 
The solution is this. We cannot malore onto or within floor 6. However, we can malore off of floor 6 to any other floor. Perhaps I maybe should have given you a hint before I revealed this. So, if I go up to here, to floor 1... You can see the check mark is now at 0, 0. That is actually where we are. This game will tell you where you are within the floor before you move the cursor to warp there. And so we can see I am starting at 0, 0. Now this is floor 1, not floor 6. I do need to still map it out manually. But uh, I will I will show you kind of an example of what I'm talking about here. If I go to floor 1, back to 0, 0. Uh, if I come over here, let's say, I'm now at, like, 5-0, and let's say, eh, for whatever reason, I decide I'm going to go down to 4-3. But before I actually do that, you can see the check mark is now at 6-0. It's telling me my current location on the current floor, which is awfully nice of it. So, if I bail out of it, I keep the more charge. So that is, that is the intended solution for uh, how you map out this final floor. In earlier versions, because you didn't get the screenshot, um, the the solution was actually to simply malore up one floor or two floors or however many floors you felt safe maloring up, and then doing the and then casting Dumavic to check what your coordinate was. All right, with that done, let's let's actually prepare here. Alright, so I think Mopporfic, I think Blood 2 Mapic actually also goes away on floor 6, which is very interesting. Um, so that's why I'm maloring to these stairs to floor 6 and not actually to floor 6. But let's, uh, let's check out what's on floor 6, shall we? Oh, whoops. I just said all that. Good job, me. Try that again. Ah. Stairs down, yes. Okay, stairs up. No. All right, here we go. So, we're now on floor six. We can start trying to map it out. There's a wall there, or there's a door there. Hidden door, great. Good. An encounter. One giant. We don't know what kind of giant this is, which is a little frightening. Because there's only one of them, I think our plan of attack is to just attack. Bio.com couldn't hide. That's not great. Mercury charges a giant and hits seven times for 72. It survives. Silver attempts to slice giant. It's seven times for 194. Yeah, there's not much in the game that's surviving that. Okay. Let's inspect this chest. Poison needle, you say. All right, let's disarm this. You disarmed the trap. Kyle, I found armor. And you survivor got some gold. That's neat. I surprise monster. Well, that's good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I am happy we surprised this. Uh, greater demons are some of the most frightening things in this game. The, uh, the Hellmasters and Hellhounds are no slouches either. But, um, 
There are a couple ways I can try to go about this. Um, I think we're going to try to take out the Hellmasters and the Hellhound. Silver is just going to swipe with the Greater Demons. So I don't know how resistant the Hellmasters are to magic. The Greater Demons are quite resistant to magic. This may be a very short stream. Um, I don't know if that's going to do anything, but I might as well try it. A little high. Okay. Yeah, the Greater Demons. Oh, Greater Demon. All right, cool. I actually smacked a couple of them with Tilt Weight. That's good. Greater Demons, okay, that's alright. We're actually, we're in much better shape now than we were, so I'm okay with how that went. Um, if I try that again and just see what happens, I think I do. Live.com backstabbed Greater Demons and hit five times for 48. Nice, we killed it. Alright, Mercury, use cause gauntlets. Yep, resist, resist. All right, we killed the Hellmaster. That's nice. Hell, I try to slash Greater Demons. Nine times for 92. Greater Demon is killed. Greater Demon cast La Halito. Ow. I got come backstabs. Greater Demon and misses. Greater Demon cast Molito. Okay. Mercury charges at Greater Demon. It hits seven times for 70. Greater Demon is killed. <sighs> 33,000 experience, folks. All right, inspect. Gas bomb. Sure. Disarmed the trap. Mercury found stone. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's use that Knight of Diamond shield and get ourselves back to full strength. Oops. Knight of Diamond Shield, so good. Okay. We have an armor and a stone. Alright, we still have some inventory space, which is nice. Everybody has had a good weekend so far. Okay, seemingly just a dead end. Is it a dead end? I don't know. It is not! There was a hallway there the whole time. There was a door there. Silly video game. Casting this. I don't think it. I think after I take a step, it will. It will go away. An encounter! Okay. Two giant zombies, two modeled figures, three doomed kids. Alrighty. Let's try to get rid of the giant zombies first. Change my mind. We're gonna get rid of the modeled figures. We'll try and dispel the giant zombie. See if that does anything. And we'll hide. Okay, I got how hides. Silver hits. Silver crushes a modeled figure. So really does not dispel. Okay. Kill the modeled figures. That's nice. Giant zombies resisted the spell. Doom Toads did not resist the spell. Giant zombie breathes on the party. Ow. Okay. That's a thing they can do. Good to know. Killed. Giant zombie is killed. Okay. 15,000 experience. These enemies are giving a ton of experience, which I guess I shouldn't be that surprised at. He was found with sword. Alright, you know the drill. <laughs> Hmm. 
need to make sure we are topped off on health. For reasons that are hopefully becoming obvious. Okay. Okay, that was either a spinner or a teleporter. I don't know which one. Uh, so we can go Malor. Uh, so 15, 8. Uh, that is a spinner. Okay. Good to know. Also a spinner? Fifteen nine. Okay, so currently I am facing I'm facing the door. That is also a spinner. Okay. Good to know. That, I presume, is also a spinner. What a- what a room, folks. What a fun room. Uh, yep, that is also a spinner. Great. Monster surprised me. I don't know how much I like that. Okay, Will O Wisps are fine. Okay, two Will O Wisps I can use. Truthfully, aren't that bad. They're hard to hit, but I am extremely high level. I'm not super worried about it. A trap was triggered! Oops, poison needle! Certainly found considered. Unpoison you. Alright. Alright, so we got that. Cool. Ouch, I had to check. An encounter! I surprise monster. Well, that's good. Six blobs. That is not that is not incredibly helpful. Okay, whatever they are, they are wow, they are chunky and they are resistant to spells. Okay. Oh, uh, this is frightening. Um Don't totally know what to do here. Um, Tino? Question mark? Tag.com was found. Okay. Blob missed, blob missed. Okay. Uh, they are hitting me. That's. Okay. That's a little. It's just a blob, yeah. Blob is killed. Okay. Blob is decapitated. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Luckily, I am pretty ludicrously overleveled at this point, I would say. In as much as one can be ludicrously overleveled in wizardry. I know that's not really a thing, but to the extent it's possible. 
Trapless chest, you say? Uh, I want a second opinion on that one. Okay. Oops, found armor. Snurdly found armor. Right, I am, yes. I am recovering Kyle Eye's health. Everyone else still looking pretty good. Ouch. An encounter! Monster surprised me. I don't think I like that. Giant crab! So, here's this giant enemy crab. There's a lot of giant crabs, actually. Okay. I think they're resistant to spells, but I'm going to try it anyway. Oh, never mind. Okay. They're very chunky. Several of them outright survived that, but they are not resistant to spells. How are you today, Alnesia? You're doing well. The trap was triggered! Ooh! Teleporter. Oh boy. All right. Uh, okay. Well, this just got interesting. You have work to do. Oh no. Where are we now? We are at 12 7. Okay. So I think I'm facing east. All right, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. If I go north. All right, so what we're looking at is something like this. Okay. South is a long hallway. Okay. I saw there was a door here, so I'm gonna go that way and encounter. A surprise monster. Well, that's helpful. Two high masters, a man in robes, two lesser demons, and three master ninjas. Uh, this, okay, that's, uh, that is a selection. <laughs> that is a selection. Luckily, I got the jump on him, so, um,. The lesser demons may actually not be the worst of my problems here, frankly. Very... Right, that's right, this is okay. High Masters are killed, High Masters are killed. Okay. Alright, we're alright. We're down to a lesser demon. We can handle the lesser demon. It's six times for 330. Right, I think Hrathnir has, like... Uh, criticals against demon properties. <laughs> oh, and we decapitated it, too, just for good measure. Oh, spectacular. All right. Oh, man. That was, uh, yeah. It was good. All right. Let's, okay, let's inspect this chest, shall we? Gas bomb, you say. Okay. You disarmed the trap. Shubes found dagger. Okay. Right, I'm just taking a look at my inventory, because as it starts getting full, I'm at some point going to want to actually bail out of here. The room is filled with bloody smell.
You notice some words on the lower part of the wall. Uh, yeah, that would that would not have been good. The ambush broke the other way. You are correct. They seem to be written with blood. I will leave it to the brave who brought back the stuff. To this day, I have no idea if stuff is a mistranslation of staff, or they're talking about, like, the Knight of Diamonds gear. I really have no idea. But anyway, uh, that's this room. Can we get out of here? Uh, we can. I don't know which way I actually went to get out of here, though. Um, I think I went right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pseudo my lore. Let me just check on that. Uh, 1410, where I should be. Yes, okay. Two, all right, yep, that makes sense. And that will take me back in here. Okay, I don't know if that's one way or what. Nothing there. What over here? Nothing there either, okay. This takes me back to here. That is a one-way door, okay. Uh, what? Where am I? Oh, there I am, okay. One, two, right. An encounter! This is where I got teleported away before. That is a lot of hornets, okay. These might act- no, I think I can- I think I can do that. There's just a lot of them. Uh, you have a lot of spell charges, so you're gonna cast Malignant. Okay, miss, 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 miss. Things are fast. There we go, okay. Okay, we're good. Trapless chest. I want a second opinion on that. Okay. Open the chest, Kyla. I got confound knob. Stick. Okay. Okay, so that's a teleporter back to... All right, that's a teleporter back to the start. Good to know. All right, this is also T1 Prime, because that's how I write this. Uh, no, we're gonna not do that. We're gonna bail out back to the castle. Okay. With our newfound loot. Spells. Uh, why did I do that? I need to get the equipment off of him. Also, Itsudemo is now level 10, as a result of being named a Knight of the City. Okay. Item trade. We are going to take all of the all of the pieces of equipment from all of the people, or at least four pieces of equipment. Stone. All right. We'll start there. Identify this armor. Treated leather. Cool. A stone stone. Okay, sure. Silver chain. Neat. And a scroll of Halito. Scroll of Halito is whatever. Stone stone is intriguing. So the, the stone stone is is worthless slash worthless slash priceless, which is very interesting. Um, I don't totally know what to do with that information, to be honest. Because basically anything in this game that you know you can invoke the special power of is kind of a crapshoot. <laughs> I know what some of the items do, but I don't know what all of them do. And the stone stone is one of them I do not know where that is. So we're 
and trade this to trade it to Shubes for now, I guess. Oh, while I'm here. You know what to do. Or identifying. Sort of slashing. Nice. Okay. Added leather. Sure. Whatever. I don't have a clue. Dagger of speed. Okay. I don't know. They're mesa pounding. All right. But dagger of speed is an interesting item in that it doesn't give a whole lot of damage, but it gives you a ton of extra hits. And it might actually also be cursed, if I remember right, too. We want to keep the Sword of Slashing. We're going to give that to Mercury. That'll be an upgrade over the Sword of Slicing. Not Adventures in. What am I doing? Oh, I need to... Did I sell Mitsu's equipment? I don't remember. I did, okay. Except for the Dagger of Speed, which I actually want to keep. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, I don't remember what it does either, yeah. Ace of Misfortune. Well, good job not getting cursed by it, anyway. We done! Okay. Um, okay. Let's see. Yeah, sure. Give it to Kyle Life. Move Itsu. Add lag. Read that to lag.com. So let's find out if I'm right on this. So he, for some reason, cannot equip the dagger of speed. Okay. Shubes can equip the Dagger of Speed, but Shubes as a mage should never, frankly, have a reason to. Sure. Okay, interesting. So it's... So it's not... Okay. So the Dagger of Speed is not cursed, but it does raise your armor class. I'm sort of unsure what to do with this information. So I think you can kind of do more damage with it, but on the other hand, the armor class penalty isn't great, but on the third hand, as I've said before, if I'm in a position where I'm like, where Shoobs has to be a frontline fighter, I am probably already as good as dead. So... that makes sense. I don't know what's better between the dagger of slicing and the blade of lightning. I, don't, I actually don't know. Like, I imagine one of these is like a dagger plus one, one is a short sword plus one. But try that for now, I guess. Alright, 
so we have redone our inventory. Okay. Take a sip of water here. Once again, I am doing some hacking bamboozling. I have a Diet Mountain Dew bottle, which actually does not have Diet Mountain Dew in it. It has um, orange tangerine flavored water. And then I have this ordinary glass, which contains Diet Mountain Dew. Okay, let's uh, let's get that one You cast my lore down to the sixth floor. Okay. Now, let's explore over here, this door. Okay, so we have... Monster surprised you, okay? Scorpion tries to gnaw Mercury and misses. Crustacea tries to nibble on Kyle and misses. She bites at Kyle and misses. Scorpion just left Sulphur and misses. Tries to gnaw Kyle and misses. Tries to gnaw Kyle and misses. Just left Silver. Three giant crabs, five scorpions, large quantity of both. Um. I feel like that's the play. We'll try to fight the scorpions, see what happens. Very, very hide. Lower charges at scorpions, crushes it. Okay. Should be good. Oh, someone actually hit us. Uh, also, crabs resistant to cold. I guess makes sense. Twice for 16. Eight times for 108. Eight times for 104. Okay. A chest. Lag.com can gain a level. Okay, sure, I trust you. You disarm the trap. Silver found a sword, Mercury found a helm. And we got a bunch of gold. Okay. So we have what appears to be a room where we just can't do anything. Aha! Secret door. Tried game. There's not a door there, okay. But over here, there's a door and an encounter. A surprise monster, that's good. Fuzzballs, lots and lots of fuzzballs. Not individually dangerous, I don't think. The problem is they can call for help and they can just, the battle can just take forever. As well. Can I just spell fuzzballs? I don't know. They can use the stone stone in battle, interesting. Uh, let's give it a shot. Okay, it's some kind of attack spell. Right there. Yep, this is okay. Well, can I hit one of them, maybe? No? Okay. Okay, well... I don't think I can suffocate a fuzzball, but you know. Okay. 
did not work. Okay. All right. Interesting. They didn't do anything again. Weird. Okay. I mean, I'm okay with that, but... Oh, there they go. Okay. Yep, I'm just gonna have to... Yeah, that's that's how this is gonna have to work. I'm just gonna have to mash, mash, mash. Oh, I think it's only the... I think it's only the, like, topmost group that can actually call for help. Okay. I know that. I can kind of control this a little bit. Think. Oh, never mind. I see what's going on here. Okay. Right. Okay. Yep. I'm gonna have to chip away at this. There's, there's nothing I can really do. We're down to three groups now. I'm just gonna have to mash this down. Nothing else I can really do. Okay. And the best part is these things give like no experience. That's the best part. I'm gonna get like literally 10 experience for this. If that. Although they haven't even tried attacking. Turn order there, that was fun. Hey! Okay, 15 experience, excuse me. Alarm. Okay. The trap was triggered! Oops, poison needle! Well, I found some armor though, that's neat. I thought they, I thought they could, uh, okay. Oh, I wonder if maybe that's why they, if that's why they give no experience, because the original Wizardry 1 algorithm was just like, oh, um, you know. Because in, uh, in Wizardry 1, enemies don't have specific experience value. Like, they do, but they're not hard-coded. It's like an algorithm that takes into account all of their other properties and then spits out a number. So I can see how that would yield, um, you know... That would yield zero experience if they have, like, one hit point and are easy to hit and only call for help and don't actually attack.
Right, yeah. Yeah, one hit point, but they have, like, ludicrous spell resistance. Yeah. But they don't actually have ludicrous spell resistance, because spell resistance is a big component of, uh... Like, I imagine they're somehow faking that, because if I remember right, spell spell resistance is actually a huge component of that experience algorithm. Up or down here? Um, go this way. Sure. Right, okay. Okay, so there's right because they have. Okay, so they have like a hundred. They could theoretically attack a hundred times, which I believe is how the game determines. Like, the, the enemy level, as I understand it, is just kind of the number of attacks they can take, or their hit dice. Somehow their hit dice calculation is, yeah. There is, to my left, that is this way, I believe. An encounter. A surprise monster. Well, that's good. Uh, yikes. Okay. Good thing I surprised this, because this looks frightening. I'm just gonna fight these, and then... Uh, I don't expect the Ring of Suffocation to necessarily do anything, but we're gonna try it anyway. times for 50. Okay, so the Black Dragons aren't super... It's fine. Lahalito is less fine. One Black Dragon. Should be. One swing for every other hit die. Oh, interesting. Huh. Because I know that, like, Greater Demons, for instance, actually have very distinct damage dice. Like, they have however many attacks, but each attack is actually a different value. Age Blaster. Disarmed the traps. Nerdly found armor. Great. Alright, let's everyone heal up. You know the drill by now. Yeah, but Arch Demons are also incredibly rare. So. Yeah, everyone, yeah. Like, the, the information is all out there, as is, for instance, the information on, like, what these what the various items do. Like, I could go look it up. That's that's not the problem. Like, I know some of it, but not all of it, and I'm kind of trying to keep it that way just for, you know, mystery slash intrigue sake, I guess. So yeah, it's just kind of a dead end there. Interesting. I go this way. No. Let's go up here. An encounter. 
Surprise monster. Well, that's good. Oh, speaking of our boy, the Archdemon. <laughs> good thing I got the jump on this one. Um, okay. I believe this is like an Archdemon, four greater demons, and then two, I don't even know, like her Jai, maybe? Can I try dispelling? I don't think that's gonna work, but let's try it anyway. Actually, same thing for the stone stone. Still don't know what that actually does. Let's try that. Come on, ooh, okay. Uh, stone stone is a uh, silence, it's Montino. Archdemon is decapitated, because we're level 25. Get, okay. Those are indeed greater demons. Yep, okay. Uh, I think just fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Uh, parry, or I guess keep trying the stone stone. So greater demons, for those who don't know, are uh, frightening. They can poison, they can paralyze, they can cast some pretty nasty spells, though thankfully not tilt away. They can summon other greater demons. They are very highly resistant to magic. They are nasty. If you are not incredibly over level, then even if you are, as I kind of am, uh, greater demons will end you. <laughs> Seven times for 364. Fortunately, Hrathmir, uh, like I said, does appear to do some sort of critical hit damage to demons. You survivor got seven, 27,000 experience. All right, uh, let's back to this chest. Crossbow bolt, okay. He disarmed the traps, nerdly found gloves and a shield. That's neat. <sighs> okay. Also, Snurdly can also level up. So choose. A lot of room for inventory, so. Uh, that was either a spinner or a teleporter. I'm guessing it was a spinner. Kind of based on the contour of this room. I'm gonna confirm that. Uh, I am at 12-12. Which, um, well, yes, that is indeed a spinner. Okay. Okay, so there's a door up here. Cool. Or here, which is also, I believe, a spinner. Here, I believe there's a, again, a kind of nasty encounter awaiting here if I so choose to do it. Although not the nasty encounter. Make sure I'm still where I think I am. 12-11. Yep, that's right. All right, so this was also a spinner, I believe. Is that what I said? Yep, because that was definitely not the way I was facing before. There is a tomb in the ruined room. The tombstone is broken off too badly that you cannot read anything but the epitaph. Worthless rests here. Okay, interesting. Th they did actually correct this typo for this version. In the original Famicom NES Wizardry Knight of Diamonds, or the Famicom one specifically, uh, they misspelled here H-E-A-R, like, you know, to, to perceive sound, not in this location. They corrected that for the NES version, and then they apparently kept that correction and seemingly only that correction here. Okay. Fine. I'm not, not going to worry about it. Ouch. Okay, I can't go there. Alright, so this is a tomb.
Uh, what? Oh, okay. I'm not where I thought I was. No, my bad. Okay. That's where I thought I was. Okay. Let me my lore and make sure here, pseudo my lore. I can't imagine having to do this in, like, the original versions, where you have to actually cast Malor to be able to do something like this. Uh, that was not a spinner square, that was just me. So we'll leave me back there. So that is all okay. Hmm. All right, so I guess, let's see. We're sort of up there. One Archmage, one Man in Black, four suck you by, two strange animals. I don't think that's going to get rid of the suck you by or the... Or maybe the strange animals. I should be able to take out the Archmage and the Man in Black. I don't think they're particularly resistant to spells, so... Killed the Archmage. Killed the man in black. Oh, okay. Actually got everything but one succubus. That's nice. Uh, I'm just gonna try to... I'm just gonna hope we hit it before it hits us. Okay. Priest Blaster, huh? Uh, I would like a second opinion on that. Okay. Well, I found six. Shoes found stone. Shoes found another stone. Great. Good. Are we on the very definitely? We are on the very definitely. We are actually on the kind of post game because this game works a little strangely in that most of the last floor you have no need to actually explore it. You do, or at least you're supposed to, in the PC version of this game. Where there's a riddle you have to answer, and, like, early in the in the final floor, there's a riddle you have to answer. And the idea is you go around the last floor looking for, like, the hints to the riddle. But if you just know what the riddle is, you can just answer it, too. Um, but... Uh, to the extent that the game has a final boss, yes. That's a fight. Um... Uh... I... The Iron Golems might not actually be the worst thing here. That might be the demonic figure. I don't know what that's going to do, but we're going to try it anyway. Same thing for the stone stone on, I don't know, the iron golems. We'll try that and see what happens. Oh, Master Ninjas, why are you getting good turn order? Please stop that. Okay. Oh, iron golems are not, yep, demonic figures, not surprised. That went the way it did. Okay. Iron gol- oh boy! Okay, I think uh, I think we have a new priority now. <laughs> um, okay, spell. Uh, you, Madi. Oh, and my mage is dead. Okay, that's spectacular.
Oh, that is actually incredibly problematic. Okay. Um, all right. Well... <laughs> Am I okay? Uh, no, frankly. But we're gonna try to get through this. Okay, we got the... Okay. Should be alright from here. Okay, we got there. <laughs> Uh, well... <laughs> I did not realize Iron Golems could breathe on the party. That- that was a- that was a not very fun surprise. Yeah, the, uh, this game is very Dungeons & Dragons inspired. Ah. With a bakery stat. <laughs> Piety. Okay. An encounter. Alright. Well, what do we got? <laughs> His game is just not letting up. Wow. Okay. I don't think greater demons can call other greater demons. I'm not sure what the second thing is. Succubi, maybe? through whatever that was. And this should send me back here. Okay, so now the problem is I still have to walk out. I have to walk out at least back to floor four, so. If I can get back to floor four, then I should be okay, because I can warp back from there. Oh wait, actually, I know what I should have done. Okay. Outside of the outside of that, you don't actually have anything super important. Okay, that's good. All right. Uh, does anybody have that much money? Uh, Mercury does. Okay. Here we go. Fingers crossed. This works better for shoes than it did for corn. Chance, pray, invoke. Tubes is cured. All right. All right. <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. All right. All right, let's have everybody stay at the end. Snurgly. Gain six hit points, not bad. Lag.com. Gain 16 hit points, are you kidding me? And pie. Learn how to make a delicious apple pie. Let's lag.com up a little longer. Closer you to leveling. 
30,000. Maybe could have gotten there had we not eaten it on the iron golems. Okay. Identify Mesa Power. That sounds like fun. Treated Leather. Okay. Helm of Hardiness. Okay. And we got cursed. Alright. We got cursed by the S Sword of Dismay. That one we probably. That one I don't think caught yet. Yeah, Alright, so everyone else, I think all of the other people have Homes of Hardiness already. At least two of them do. Yeah. Um, do I wanna, what wanna do with that? How much can I sell that for? That's not that bad. Okay. We'll take that, that, and we'll give the Stomach is going. Blah, 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 blah. It was a good. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, I would give it to Snurdly, but I can't. Right, so take that. I'm kind of. Well, I invoke the special power of my Blarney Stone. No, you don't need it right now. If it does what I believe it does. Treated leather, loves a copper, shield of support. Sounds like fun. Slash sturdy plate, shield of support. Hey, nice. All right. God's gauntlets. Uh, item. Can I use the shield of support? No, I cannot. Okay. Wonder if it does something in battle. <laughs> yeah, jackal. Yeah. Not Yitsu Uh, Mercury. I don't want to solve the gloves of copper just yet. Stone. Ooh, first class plate. Let's go. Uh, I could give that to... Oh, I never actually... Uh, hold on. That's not who I want to give that to. Take that back. Uh, I want to give that to Kyle-I. Kyle-I currently has a year's sturdy plate. Sword slashing. First class plate. Minus nine. Two of evil. Cosm. Alright, um. So be sturdy, plate. Okay. So here's another Blarney Stone. I can give that to. I don't know who I want to give that to. I do know who I want to give that to. The problem is they're not in the party right now, so. Give it to you again for now. So the Blarney Stone gives a, I believe, it gives a one-time charge of all your spell levels to nine.
fighting. I think that's everything I want to do there. Tubes. Knees. Uh, reorder. Silver. Tubes. Starting to run out of inventory space, which is a little concerning. But... I'm gonna check out some stuff. Okay. Orphic. Or not item. Uh, or down to the stairs to floor six, which are here. Yes. Up. Up. Aha! There's a wall there. It is beyond my support from here on. Take care and go. I don't know quite what that means, but... Yes, I mean, this being wizardry, you are likely correct, but it's not wrong. Well, it didn't fizzle out my magic, so that's good. That's gonna immediately, that's gonna immediately get canceled out, but that's fine. actually is nothing there. Okay, beyond my support. Alright, well, let's go this way then. An encounter! Of course there is. Four gold dragons. Okay. Gold dragons cast Delto, you say. Okay. That wasn't nice. Gold dragon. Okay. The chest. Inspect. Alarm. The trap was triggered! Oops! Priest Blaster. Oh, that's not great. Okay. We got a lot of stuff out of that, so that was nice. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna bail out of here. <laughs> we're gonna not keep that. We're gonna we're gonna temple of cows. Luckily, that luckily paralysis is guaranteed to be cured. Uh, I actually, now that I think about it, could I have? No. Okay. Dialco is a level three spell. Did Shoops just get all of that.
have a clue. Another Blarney Stone. A Ring of Jewels, that's cool. I don't need a second one, I think. A Potion of Dial, that's actually not terrible, but... Um, alright, I can sell all that, I think. Including the Blarney Stone, I have two already. Will you take the Blarney Stone? Not interested in that item. Uh, you know what? Sure, let's try it. Okay, so we invoked the special power. I don't know what it did. Up to their IQ, maybe? The problem is, I don't know. Alright, well, anyway. to add Snurgly back. Yes, I know I need to reorder, but first I'm just gonna... Uh, I don't need to remove anybody. I just need to reorder. Okay. Snurgly, then shoes. Okay, now. Torfic. On my support. Encounter. Try to not get priest blasted this time. One air giant, three unseen entities, and nine creeping coins? Creeping coins, that's whatever. Alright, whatever the unseen entities are, they're dead. Coins are also gonna be dead. Alright. Easy game. Mage Blaster. Disarm that, please. Disarm the trap. She was found armor. Cool. Okay. 
Can't go that way. An encounter! <sighs> really? It's not like this is a difficult fight. But you see the problem here. So the thing is, if the group already has nine, they won't do anything. They do nothing. They just call... They just call monsters. That's all they do. I believe they have one hit point. They, you can hit them easily. Experience. Excellent. Trapless chest, you say. Uh, I want a second opinion on that. Alright. Kaiwai. Open it, please. Mercury found armor. Stanley found dagger. Cool. An encounter. Oh, just a random encounter on the sixth floor. One like Hergis, one greater demon. Okay, well, good thing I surprised him then. He decapitated a greater demon. Like, that is how kind of absurdly strong I am. Also, a hidden door here. Is there one here? No. Okay, so there are doors there. And there are doors in there. Okay. I want to go this way, though. Boom. An encounter. Oh, hey, it's our boy, the Archdemon, again. Okay. With five greater demons and two Hellmasters. Lovely. Um, okay. <laughs> I don't think it's going to do much, but... Archdemon is killed, okay. Uh, this could be bad. Oh, Hellmasters have spells, too. Great, wonderful. Okay. Tubes is dead. Okay. Bag.com is not doing great either, actually. Okay, we got the greater demons. Bag.com is killed. Okay, two Hellmasters. Alright, we should be able to at least survive this. Okay, parting shot there. But we got 48,000 experience. Unfortunately, I can't do anything with this chest. I mean, I could try, but... Priest Blaster, yeah, no, we are, we are bailing out on that one so hard. Alright, so first things first, let's... Everybody.
Yeah, there's no such thing as cozy in Wizardry. Like, maybe there is if you're watching. There is no such thing as cozy if you're playing it, however. As you have probably gathered by this point. Kanorto! Okay. Great. And Kanorto! Okay. They're back. They back, baby. That's frightening. Okay, so you're here. That's just an ordinary door, thankfully. The most evil voice you've ever heard echoes. Where is the stuff now? So, in the PC version, you could acquire a Staff of Light here, which would basically let you cast Lomilwa as much as you want. However, Lomilwa doesn't even work on this floor, so... Yeah, a little bit useless. Yeah, okay. So, how's everybody's... Okay, so yeah, I think it lowered... Alright, yeah, lowered their vitality. So, that's, that's okay. What do we got here? We have... Alright, so that will take me back that way, it looks like. Also go this way. That, I'm guessing, is a one-way door. This may or may not be a one-way door. Five air giants. Giants, incredibly tanky. Also hit hard. Oh, we got there. All right, thirty-four thousand experience. Easy game. Mage blaster. Okay. Then disarm a mage blaster, please. Disarm the trap. Silver found armor. Great. And I immediately get another encounter just because. Uh, these I believe are poison giants. Which is not great. I want to use the Ring of Suffocation in that case. And cast on Mom Moralis, I guess. Just like, just like, Okay, uh... Alright, somehow we're still alive. Encounter. Monster surprised you. Okay. Blobs, oh boy. Oh, how many blobs are there? 14 altogether, okay. The good news is like, they're incredibly tanky. I don't think they have, and I think they're kind of resistant to spells as well, from what I remember. But the good news is I don't think they have any particular special abilities. They're just incredibly hard to take. They're just incredibly tanky. I silenced one. Whatever that's worth. Yeah, okay, I can... Yeah. I don't think it's even worth trying to... Alright, I do need to kind of keep an eye on
Okay. 28,000 experience. Excellent. Disarmed the trap. Snurdly found some stuff. That's neat. Yeah. Good. Oh, this is just a giant room. Okay. like cube here. Ouch, that I can't get into from there. Okay. Try this way, nope. Okay. Oh, this way. Yes. But there's nothing in there. Okay. There's just a okay, there's just a room that has nothing in it. Great. Oh, oh boy. Random encounter. Monster surprised me. Oh boy. Never good. Cave dweller. Okay. Giant bats. Uh, rare bats. That's, oh, one gaunt figure, two vampire bats. I think that's either a vampire or a vampire lord. Uh, that is, okay. That's, uh, that is certainly a thing. We're gonna do that. Gaunt figure casts a Dilton. All right, well, the gaunt figure is dead. That's nice. Okay, Oh, also, there's a doorway here. Okay. One man in armor, one iron golem, two lesser demons, four master ninjas. Uh, we want to... I don't know what this man in armor is. Uh, I am not dealing with a freaking iron golem. Everything else will be what it will be, but yeah. Man in armor tries to... Ow, okay. Master ninjas flee. Okay. Okay, we decapitated the Iron Golem. That's good. And an armor's still alive. It's a little frightening, but... We got him. Alright, cool. 591 gold? Are you serious? Okay. Alright, so there's also a door here, it looks like. Okay. And then that just goes up there. Okay. To what I'm guessing is going to be... Okay, sure. Alright, so that presumably is a one-way door. Are we on inventory space? We still got some. Okay. That's just a doorway that leads nowhere. Cool. Um, let's see. Could this lead anywhere? Not really, but... Uh, 
that's just, again, something that leads nowhere. Yep, that's a one-way door, as I expected. Alright, so there's a series of encounters here. One giant, easy fight. Disarm the trap, great. Counter. <sighs> really? I'm almost tempted to just run, but... The only purpose of this encounter is to waste time. So some of the, like, flavor text tiles that you saw, flavor text tiles, not flavor text tiles, don't go eating the things. Um, um, those are kind of where the hints to the, uh, to the final riddle would be kind of in the PC. Roughly, because these dungeons are compressed slightly. They're in about the same location. And you would get there via different means. Blaster. Uh, can I get a second opinion on that? Yeah. Disarm the priest blaster, please. Disarm the trap. Shoop found sword. Kyle, I found stone. An encounter. I surprise monster. Well, that's good. Two strange animals, one high priest, five orc lords, nine wear -amigos. Okay. Sure, video game. Um, fight the high priest, I guess. God's gauntlets. Fight the strange animal. Ring of suffocation. Uh, stone stone the orc lords, because I vaguely remember those. I want some high priest is killed. God Gauntlet's very helpful there. Alright, got it down to one strange animal. Strange animal breathes on the party. Ow. Okay, Shoes is dead. Great. Could not disarm it. Well, that means we have the right trap anyway. Bailing out back to town. <laughs> After that, cool. Tubes is dead again. <laughs> uh, Kyle, I. I for uh, Shubes, please. Invoke. Tubes is cured. Great. All right, phew. <sighs> Add our boy Shubes back in. We're getting a lot of loot from this, obviously. Alright, let's have everybody rest up here. Alright, first up, Kyli, level up. 30 hit points for Kyli, incredible. Mercury's turn. Mercury, one whopping hit point. Nicely done. Okay. Silver's turn. Two hit points. Hey, that's better than that's better than one. So there's that. Uh, Snurdly will refresh your spells. 
Yeah, exactly. One hit point for uh, Lag. And for Shoobs, we have Vitality. All right, we gained the Vitality point back. That's nice. And one bullet. All right, so now we have a bunch of gear we need to... I'm going to just remove shoes for the moment. While I clear some inventory space out from other people. Die. I still don't know what the Blarney Stone actually does. Um, if I get another Blarney Stone, I'll just drop this one. All right, so 1917. I wonder if instead of making everything 9, it just refreshes everything? Vitality is now 8. Alright, 16, 18. Alright, Oh, okay, it's raising, okay, it's raising uh, Itsu's luck by one. I see. That's what's going on. Okay. Hmm. Don't know how useful that really is, but sure. Oops. Stone. Oh, I think that's actually the one that really wrote and chain. Okay. All right. So first off, uncurse that. Secondly, sell the broken breastplate. I think the mind stone is actually what I'm thinking of, not the Blarney stone. So okay, what I want to do that. So I need to actually be careful because that might actually be one of the items that Wear Slayer, that's me. Body armor. Okay. I think the Wear Slayer is necessarily better than any of my previous weapons though. Not interested in that item. Speed. Scroll of Low Milwa, that's neat. I would like the Scroll of Low Milwa more if Low Milwa actually worked on floor six. Just sell a dagger of speed. This is going to be able to use that, so. Actually, I think, use the facilities, run a quick ad, all that good stuff. Um, I will be right back. Um, I will run the clip show for subscribers. Uh, sit tight. Also, let me mute this for now. One moment, everyone. Remember, remember when I said, just in case, remember when I remembered to unmute the game. There we go. All right, cool. We're back. Thank you, everybody, for your patience. 
appreciate it. Um, okay, what do we want to do here? We want to go back in the maze. Um, let's see. Have I gotten everything off of these characters? I have. Okay. So with that, let's remove lag and add shoes. Trade those to Itsu. What do we got? Don't have a clue. Don't have a clue. Sword slashing. Me. Entry and bother. Okay. Maybe I want to hold on to the sword of slashing. I'm just not totally sure how I want to go about that. I think I am totally sure how I want to go about that. One moment. Okay, so first off, sell the tree flower. That's whatever. Sword of slashing. We want to keep. I do want to do that. Well. Remove another of these characters, and let's add. Let's add this friend out. You will use the pre-created character as as a storage space for some of the stuff that I don't need immediately. Might at some point hint into like judge. Okay. Uh, all right. So now we can remove Itsu. Re-add Kyle and Lag. Lag.com up to level twenty-eight. That's kind of neat. Alright, so reorder. We want Kyli in the front, then Mercury, then Silver, then Snurdly, then Shoes, then Lag. Excellent. Okay. Yes, you want to do that. Okay, so. Hey, how's it going, Shub? An encounter! I surprise monster. Well, that's good. Strange animal, one priest, nine, three orc lords, nine were amoebas. Okay, so the strange animal was kind of nasty from what I remember. I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna fight the strange animal. Everything else we can we can worry about at a later time. I don't think the Ring of Suffocation did anything here. I don't think the Stone Stone is going to do much, but we'll try it anyway. Well, we silenced the Orc Lords. That's nice. All right, cool. All right, all right. Orc Lords is alive. All right, so we have two, two Chonk Orc Lords to deal with here. Killed one. And got the second. Disarmed the trap. Shoes found armor. Great. All right, so we have this room here. It's kind of a large room, actually. that, we have actually kind of mapped out most of this floor. So, is is the game over? Have we completed the post-game? Well... Let me pull up the webcam here, and I will kind of show you. I'll show you all the map we've got so far. So, there is my ugly mug. That's not what we're here for. We're here for this. We're here for Wizardry 2 Game Boy Color for 6. So you can see we start down here by A. Uh, you can see the uh, two F5. You can see some of the notes that I've made. Um, but you'll kind of notice uh, there are a couple areas that are just sort of sealed off. 
Uh, for instance, this area kind of beginning at, let's say, three east, one north. That sort of nine square room there. Just doesn't seem to be way into it. Uh, similarly, kind of in the middle there, there's a whole huge chunk that doesn't seem to have a way into it. And then there's this little hallway at, I believe that's nine north to east. Which is kind of sealed off, as well as that whole perimeter there. How do we get there? Yes, thank you for that. Um, I had forgotten because I was showing the map here, and then I forgot to unshow the map. Luckily, I'm not doing anything of super importance, I would say. There we go. It's back. Um, I had just started kind of equipping and unequipping characters in preparation for making a second person with the Mark of Nova. That was the idea here. All right, so we want to unequip that, unequip that, that. You keep that, you equip that. Okay. Now we want to trade with... Oops. We want to trade with... If you're down here... Alright, we'll stay down there, huh? Yeah, there we go. Let's trade that and take that. Trade this, and trade that, trade this, and trade this. One, two, three, four, okay, cool. Uh, you also need this. Okay. Finally. Now I want to let me divide my gold, then remove lag, then add Itsu, then give my gold to Itsu. Okay. Then remove Itsu. Then remove everybody. All right. So I kind of hope this works. I hope this works the way I expect it to. I've never done this with a character who has previously acquired a mark. And that way. Left. And whoops. Uh, I want to go down. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. Teleported in down. Okay. Now I need to actually look at the map. We'll get my four or five map here. So we need to buy out of camera range. Oh no! Yo! Oh no! DLH with the sub. Thank you, my friend. Appreciate it. How have things been? It's been a while. Um, okay, we're gonna go this way. Yep, entrance to a huge cavern, sure. Yep. Yep, great, great, wonderful. Okay, so now I need to be a little bit careful. Okay. So first I can go down. Go left, off, off, down, down. Left. Same old, same old, okay. Oh. Down, down. Left, left. Down, down. Left, down to avoid a pit. Bring it subway with Matt and Morgan. Okay. Cool. Oh, okay. So that did not work the way I expected it to. Uh, okay. So that works you there if they have... Okay. Okay. Okay, 
so if I'm where I think I am... I am not where I think I am. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Am I okay? I am very much not okay right now. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so leave that. Uh, that is very much not where I expected to be. Okay. Um... Is there anything that even resembles this where I am right now? Is there a one square that... Hmm. Here's the thing, I don't actually know where I am right now. Okay, so I think I'm somewhere in the middle here. Okay. An encounter. Alright, well, I'm not over there. Five protozoa. Um, let's try the Cosmos here. Okay, whatever these things are, they are beefy. Or are these blobs, I wonder? They're blobs, okay. That makes sense. Alright, so I am now wandering aimlessly on floor six, because I this did not do what I expected it to. Um have an idea of where I am. It is very much not what I expected. Okay. Encounter. Well, I surprised monster. Well, that's good. More protozoa. Okay. Uh, this is actually the Game Boy Color version that I am playing. There is a Japanese-only Game Boy Color release of this. Oh, I'm not going to be able to get out of here at all if I'm where I think I am. Okay. Um, I need to drop something. Uh, I'm gonna drop the gloves of the copper. Two. Yeah. Surprise monster. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to, like... I'm trying to, like, work through where I am, where I could possibly be on this map. Yeah, alright. Um, so the cave dwellers, alright, I think I can get rid of everything but the, yeah. Alright, that's fine, cool, alright. I'm leaving the chests because I don't have a good way of disarming traps on them. I can heal and I can fight things, but that's... That's a lot of dragons that I'm not sure I want to fight. Hey, Happy Camper, how's it going? 
Um, yikes. I just run from this. Monster surprised me. Uh, will it wisp so fully? Okay, that's fine. Am I okay? Am I? Let's see. I somehow end up up there. So weird. Okay. Enter the room. I see a familiar figure rise, wave his arms, and shout, Mapiro Mahamajiro, Matt. Okay, we made it back. Uh, okay, we're gonna not do that again. Alright, so that warped me somewhere. I have no idea where. That was very much not what I expected to happen. Okay, good to know. Good data. Um... <laughs> So somewhere I got Mapiro Mahamadiro matted. I have no idea where. None of that made sense to me. Okay. Um. Yeah. So, okay. Uh, I'll play for probably another 15-ish minutes here. But here's the thing. That did not do what I expected it to. Um. So I'm a little unsure on how to proceed from I think... Uh, okay. Oh, well, first off, I can have Kyle gain some levels. I guess we'll do that. Another 33 HP. That's nice. Is that level 27? Okay. Add the rest of the party back in, I suppose. I wonder if that's that there. Hmm. There are a couple different ways I can approach this. And... I think the best way to do it is going to be this. Alright, so, Kyle, I unequip everything. Uh, also, finally identify the United Items. Uh, now. Okay. Trade with... Yes, okay. Uh, alright. No, stop. Swap their equipment. Yeah. Armor. And silver also takes the master. Fafnir. Don't equip Cod's armor. For Come on, yes. Okay. Okay. Silver only. All right, that's irritating. But all right, I'll make that work, I suppose. Um, what? hold on. Why? Oh, right. Yeah, done. Okay. 
So now I want to remove... Uh, actually, I want to go to the edge of town. So, yeah, I want to go to the training grounds. Uh, this is probably not going to work the way I hope it will. Who is change class? Right, you can only change class to a priest. All right, so Kyli is... Uh, I did not finish Syndicate. No, I got about halfway through. And then, uh, I think that was about when the remake of Wizardry, uh, Wizardry 1 got announced. And I was like, oh, I'm playing that. Sorry, Peter Molyneux. I'm sure Peter Molyneux understands. I uh, ah, uh, this, this is the only, uh, Yep, I'm I'm gonna do this, whether I want to or not. I think this is I think this is the play. Change class to mage. Am I sure? Frankly, no. But all right, there we go. We now have a dwarven mage in Kyli. No one in party. All right, so now we will add silver and Kyli. Send them into the maze by themselves. It do oh man, really? Okay. I was hoping maybe that would not happen. I was hoping perhaps you wouldn't get your stats reset on uh, on class change, but you do, and that's awful. Um, so we're gonna do is this. Uh, I'm gonna do this for a few minutes. Uh, this armor. Monster surprised me, that's good. Alright, and just gained 16,000 experience at a time. Alright, I don't actually need to do this a whole lot. I just need to do it enough to get Kyli up to a level 13. about 400,000 experience. And I'm gaining about 16,000 per... between 16 and 17,000 here per time I do this. As a bonus, I'm probably going to get a level or two for silver as well. sword so that my cod shield is up top. So the way this grind works is, um, essentially this, this is one of the kind of legendary items you need to beat the game, but all of the game does is basically check if you have the item in any character's inventory, and if you don't, it spawns the fight. And when you win the fight, it gives you the key item. So you win the fight, get the key item, drop the key item, and you can fight it again. And because I am incredibly strong and now have the uh, legendary sword of the game, this goes very quickly. I am a little upset because being kicked back to the uh, the minimum stats means Kyle's subsequent level growth is probably going to be terrible, but... So 
I'll do, let's see, um, 333, all right. We'll do a few more here. Ching. You know what's gonna happen is I'm gonna do this and on this level up silver is gonna gain ID. I'm gonna be really annoyed for reasons. Oop, oh, no, no, uh yeah, actually I do. So after this, I will head back to town. Should be enough to get Kyle on level 13. Oh! Okay, sure. <laughs> Another random encounter, that can happen. You can beat a random encounter and immediately get into a second random encounter. It's rare, but it happens. I uh, should have just. Uh, no. Uh, no. I didn't go back to Syndicate. I was enjoying it. Particularly in the wake of uh, this Dossember thing people are doing. I actually think Syndicate might be a good thing to go back to there. Alright, so. Stairs up, take them. So first off, let's get Silver, their level. One hit point, wonderful. Oh, another- Hey! Okay, that's not happening. Sorry. I was gonna try to do the Ode to Joy, like the high part of the Ode to Joy, but I can already tell that that's gonna end poorly. But finally, a big HP level up for Silver, and there's the IQ gain I was talking about that I was sort of hoping not to get, because I already now have a mage, but all right. So it's gonna be, all right, made the next level one hit points, yep, new spells, one hit points, yep, new spells, one hit points, new spells, one hit points, uh, new spells, one hit points, new spells, one hit points. 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 Oh, did I not quite get there? Did I not quite get to what I wanted to? I did not. I need I need one or two more of those. Okay, very good. All right, well, back in we go. Six times for 163. Okay, I'm just two hitting the Knight of Diamonds armor. Oh, that'd be cool. What I would actually really like to see someone do is get Populous running on an old, uh, on like an old DOS machine, because I'm like I'm convinced that something is up with like the speed of some of those levels that they just seem impossible to do. And I'm not the only one who's complained about it, so it's possible it's a skill issue. Yes, but I don't know that it's exclusively a skill issue. Like some of the post-level 100 levels. Oh, really? Is it any easier there? Because because there are some levels where I just don't know how you're supposed to outspeed the computer. In the next level. Alright. Learn new spells. Okay, now the question is actually, I suppose it doesn't matter what new spell you learn. Tilt it away. That's okay. Alright, now. So now, with that, we go back into the training grounds. Back to Kyle We change them back into a fighter. Not even at max speed, um, just like some of the quote-unquote default maps just seem really hard. Um, I know there's like the, the desert block in the room in like around 120 is was one of them. 
There was a rock and lava level around that point, too, that I just couldn't do. And I had to, like, go back to the previous block and sort of skip that one altogether. Um. Okay, back into the maze. Um, or, no, not drop. You don't want to equip your stuff. So now we need to... Uh, it doesn't really matter. So now I can trade. Uh, okay, so... Plate armor. Nothing. Right, the shield of evil. Okay, now we equip everybody. Oh, I need to trade that too. Oh, uh, not drop. There are, yeah. I actually don't know how this is going to do. This is going to go with... Yeah, that's, kind of, yeah, that's what I was worried about. Okay, luckily we got the decapitation. So. Only need to hit once. I... Some levels. This is all going to be one HP level up. Learn new spells. Hey, there we go. Lost strength. That's not great. Learn new spell. One HP. Lost luck. Gained one HP. One HP. One HP. One HP. Now I should be able to hit this a little more. Should be able to hit it pretty well. Maybe not. Okay. Well, this is not going as I expected it to. Can I decapitate, please? This is actually bad. I'm not doing the damage I expected to. Clearly. Can you decapitate, please? Stop missing, please. There it is, okay. Alright, here we go. 
Oh, that's why. Well, I lost two strength. Alright, I lost a strength. So it's okay. In the queue. So part of the problem is that the the uh, just the algorithms in this are really weird. Like, you just don't gain stats, like, at all. It's really annoying. I mean, you do, but barely. Like, you almost have to roll for absurd bonuses, because that's the only bonuses you're going to get. I'm going to stupidly try this again. There we go. Alright, that worked out. Uh, okay. Uh, no, what am I doing? <laughs> Strength! Incredible! Alright. Yes, okay, good. Now that I can actually attack several times, I should be able to hit it a little more frequently. I say as I go repeatedly. Okay, now we're getting some. Shing. Hey Mario, huh? Kashing. Yeah. Do 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 do. Oh, put you down there, huh? There we go. So I'll do this grind for another five minutes or so. Nice Alright. Just top off my health, even though I'm not really in any danger of dying. So I believe the decapitation algorithm actually depends in part on your level. As compared to the enemy's level.
and the enemy's level is like uh, kind of the number of hit dice they have, the number of attacks. more minutes of this and then we'll head back to town and then we'll call it a stream. This is probably the one time I would describe wizardry as cozy for the streamer, even if it's not particularly exciting per se. Although, once again, this magic armor is it's trying, it is making me effort. This will be the last one. There we go. All right. uh, I actually don't even need to do that. I can now cast my lore. That explains so much. That explains so much. That may well be why when I... When I was looking at my map of Floor 6 and couldn't make out where I was at all, this may be why. Floor 7, look at that. I can't malore there, I bounce back to where I was. But okay. Okay, now this is starting to make some sense. Okay. So, I'm wondering if there's additional post-game content in this that wasn't in any of the other- that wasn't even in NES Wizardry. Wow. That is, that is wild if it's true. And if it's not, that just let it, wow. Okay. So the, all right, there's, there's good and there's bad about this. But the bad is it means that I am probably going to have to take silver and make them a mage and a fighter again. Uh, the good is, there, there, we got some content here. Alright, anyway, let's get another few level ups. Okay. HP, one HP, yep. Lost strength again, great. Level 14 now? Yeah. Minus one strength, great. Okay. Alright, so, um, before we call it for a stream, uh, you, you, I kinda gave you a hint there, but, uh, consider this question between now and Thursday. Why would I have taken a perfectly good fighter, and knowing both that they would be knocked back to the 
the, uh, the racial minimums for a dwarf, and that stat growth is bloody terrible in this game, why would I willingly turn Kyle from a very good fighter into a mage and then back into a fighter? We, we, we have part of the answer. I would say the, the clues are there. I've given you what you need, I think, to figure that out. But just, uh, just think about that between now and Thursday. In the meantime... I am going to leave the game. I'm going to call that a stream here. Thank you all for watching. We have reached the end of stream roughly 66. I'm going to say bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube.